So CLSQ, we last spoke about CLSQ in fe early February of 2025 here. This is a very decentralized, high-technology company. Uh, it was trading at that point at around $4 a share, and now at approximately $2.50 a share. It's time to revisit SEAL and see what we, what we think about it. I have to admit, I continue to be very intrigued and excited about CLSQ, and they have a lot of strategic uh, items going on for the, the company. Uh, big into R&D, uh, they have very targeted acquisitions and are investing in startups and global expansion. This, is, this should be music to every investor's ears as this is what drives growth. Um, and they're in the areas that I'm pretty excited about right now, which is kind of launching those post-quantum uh, chips for, for security, uh, setting up global OSAT uh, presence. They're even doing that right here in the United States, right where I'm at. Uh, they're investing in quantum companies and uh, you know, overall satellite connectivity with their kind of sister company, uh, WiseKey. So very exciting areas, a lot of strategic things that are very intriguing, and the company has sold off tremendously. But let's face it, 2025 started off with a big bang, and then we lost most of the air in, in, that, in that cycle. And it's not just CLSQ. It is most technology companies have been hit, and hit rather hard. And CLSQ, being a very small cap company, uh, has, has, has gone right down with, with the bunch as the, high, the tides um, raise and lower all boats in, in that water. But there's a lot of very interesting things going on with CLSQ. Just their, their whole uh, post-quantum security and chips that they're designing and developing, the encryption, the, sat the satellites, and then set setting up the, uh, the OSAT offices in, uh, in, in countries throughout. Um, very intriguing, and they're indicating that tariffs aren't going to really hit them. Uh, they're in the high-tech space, and they're very decentralized. So. Um, what do we know? We know that they've made a number of strategic investments in, in companies. You can see some of those attachments here. Uh, we know that, that um, the IC Alps, they're trying to uh, you know, conclude on, on that acquisition, which is an ASEX uh, chip uh, developer for, for quantum ASEX chips. Uh, they're involved in kind of blockchain activities for quantum proof chips, uh, cy cyber security in, in, for quantum level security. Uh, U.S. expansion, world expansion, not hit by ter tariffs. There's a lot to like about CLSQ, but let's take a quick look at the kind of the, the numbers and, and see what they tell us. So France-based CLSQ, the numbers don't lie, but the market cap of about 270 million U.S. dollars at a price of about two dollars and fifty cents, roughly a share year to date, down 58 whopping percent. That's a lot. Over five years, down 90%. Uh, they've lost a lot of value, but this happens oftentimes. But there's a retooling that's going on with CLSQ. So there's new momentum that's being developed. There's a, new, there's a transition that is taking. And 2024 and 2025 appear to be those transition years to much bigger and better things than we could have imagined a short while ago. So with the share price that's traded between 29 cents and $11 US just in the past year, at $2.50, that's pretty modestly priced in, in that range. I think a lot of good things can happen with CLSQ. This, this, this is a small cap that is, that is well positioned and, and well backed by cash and liquidity. In fact, strong cash position recently reported of $85 million US and debt free. This is impressive for a young growth startup uh, company that's, that's looking to grow wildly in the coming, uh, in the coming months and years to come. Uh, analysts are calling for about $6 a share in, in the near term. Uh, this is a small cap that, that means it can rise quite a bit. But as we know, once some momentum starts to, to show and in, in good progress, these things can run significantly higher. I've been a buyer quite a bit in 2025, significantly increasing my position because I believe in the company, I like the mission, and I, I like how this French European company is pulling together lots of lots of uh, arrangements with other companies, lots of lots of uh, acquisitions, 
and a lot of ingenuity. Uh, they're, they're playing in the big boy space as a small company and they're succeeding. It's, it's getting there. So the way I see it is you've got a fantastic opportunity to load up at lower prices. This is a stable company, fantastic new age technology, and they're involved in the things that we want to see going forward. So I continue to acquire. Let me know what you're doing. And I hope this, hope this helps. I think you can't miss, miss out on this opportunity. The strategic initiatives alone of heavy R&D, targeted acquisitions, uh, global expansion, and, and the whole post-quantum world of chips and security and satellite connectivity is a target that can lead you to riches. Let me know what you think. We'll talk again soon.